Hey guys, today I have an absolutely amazing miracle. And what I would like to do though, although that I have provided an update below this video, I just want to let everyone know that all glory to God, we finished church number 14 of Saint Ephraim of Neamakri in Kenya. And that is the first church of Saint Ephraim to be built there. Also, there is an update on church number 15 of our Holy Mother, Panagia. And finally, we introduced church number 16. Please, if you can, try and help us because donations are a bit slow with the church buildings, but also with our feeding programs. I understand times are hard. If you can, please, these beautiful souls, just so we can help them to have food and water every month. So I'll put both links below and may your reward be eternal. So the miracle takes place at Ayo Oros, at the monastery of Hilandario. And I'll put the photos up here. So as I'm talking, you can see what the monastery looks like. And it has to do with a Serbian student from, it says, Belgrade. And his name is Petros Restovitz. So he was 19 years of age and he was an atheist, but also unbaptized. And for any parent out there that may have their kid unbaptized, please get it baptized. Because we know from our Lord that we receive the Holy Spirit. We receive our guardian angel at baptism. So he went to Ayo Oros with one of his friends and... While they were doing the baptism, and I'll put the photo here, and you can see this is Petro Restovitz. Look what was revealed at the head of the newly baptized Petros is the Holy Spirit in a form of a dove. So have a look at this photo carefully, and you can see that the dove is just above him, and there's this beautiful white divine light and of course when Petros saw this he was greatly it says signifique he was very emotional and we know from our Lord Jesus Christ as well that when he was baptized by, by Saint John the Baptist that the Holy Spirit in the form of a dove descended upon him if you have a look at this video here if you look at the beginning of it, I won't get too much into it, but I'll put the link below for you. You can actually see, I believe it was in New Mexico, in America, I believe that's where it was, where um, the photos taken during the baptism were actually from a rabbi. And that's why we know that there would, there's no way known that a rabbi would actually say or do, I guess, anything purposely to support our faith. And you can see what's been caught on camera. Everything, though, through the grace of God, because God permits it. And of course, the dove, the Holy Spirit, which is one of my favorite videos that I have shown many times before in this video here, where during Holy Communion, you can see the white light that turns into a dove, the Holy Spirit, God allowed us to see that. So to all my Orthodox brothers and sisters in Christ, there is nothing to fear in this world. We've got the Holy Spirit. We've got our guardian angel. And if we do do a mistake, let's do Holy Confession. Let's return back to God. We can see through all these beautiful revelations of God that our faith is alive. It's real. It's eternal. So let's focus on our soul as much as we focus on other things, because we never know when death comes. And if anyone wants, feel free to email me. I'll put the email below for a holy confession list. So thank you all for watching. As an unworthy sinner that I am, I pray for you all morning and night. And may our Lord, our Panagia and all the saints bless you and your families. So thank you for watching. God bless you and take care.